Hey peeps, this is Mason Velez. I'm back in my Q&A studio, or should I say, the notepad on my smartphone. So, yeah, this is Ask Mason Velez, episode 43. So this time we have 16 people responded. Yeah, actually 14 people on YouTube, and two, the last two on Google+. Alright, let's start with Need for Speed and Grand Theft Auto Fanatic Estate 2017 once again. Okay, so he gave me 11 questions. Yeah, I'm gonna have to allow that shit again. Number one, what do you think of The Simpsons and Family Guy? Number two, what's your opinion on 28 Weeks Later? Number three, what do you think of Go Animate Assaulting Videos? Number four, do you hate it when Cartoon Network always air Teen Titans Go? Number five, what's your opinion on grounded videos? Number six, what do you think of Stink Meaner from the Boondocks? Number seven, what's your opinion on Yoshi.exe? Number eight, what do you think of the word Nazi? Number nine, do you have a reason why you hate Ying Yang Yo? Number ten, what do you think of Kendra Ewing's cringy tickling videos on Go Animate? Number eleven, what do you think of Need for Speed Rivals and Mortal Kombat? 10L. You guys can call it XL, but I call it Mortal Kombat 10L. And even if you guys, if you all Mortal Kombat fans like to call it uh, Mortal Kombat X, but I call it Mortal Kombat 10. Okay, time to answer this shit. <clears throat> Number one, I like The Simpsons, and I also like Family Guy, too. Number two, uh, I never heard much of that movie. And number three, it's cringe, and I don't like it. Number four, yes I do. Number five, it's just, f it's just f fuck under, under beyond belief. Number six, <laughs> he's badass. And number seven, scariest character in Nintendo history. Number eight. That's offensive and racist against Germans. And number nine, I just don't like it, that's all. And also, that show is also overrated, in my opinion. Number ten, it is cringy, alright. And number eleven, I'm neutral to Speed Rivals, but neutral for Speed Rivals, because I never heard much of it. Uh, the Mortal Kombat XL, I love that game. Alright, our title, The Flaring Freak, gave me three questions. Actually, six questions. And yeah, three in one of those, one of my separate QA videos. Alright, number one, what do you think is the worst games ever? Uh, number two, what's your favorite Mr. Men and Little Miss characters? Uh, number three, what is the worst movie you ever watched? Number four, have you already thought of things you, you want for Christmas? Number five, what is the best movie you ever watch? Number six, what old TV show do you miss the most? Well, number one, it's Hong Kong 97 on the Super Nintendo in, J in Japan. But mostly Polybius in arcades. And number two, I don't watch Mr. M Men or Little Miss cartoon shows. I mean, I don't watch the Mr. Men show much. Number three. The worst movie I've ever watched is... Nah, I can't think of the worst movie I ever watched. I'm sorry. Number four. Not yet. Number five. Uh, the best movie I ever watched is... Is The Final Destination and... Yeah, five Final Destination films, and including How High, uh, uh, Super Troopers, and etc. Including Friday the 13th. And what old TV show you missed the most? Well, I really missed uh, The Garfield Show, Ed and Nettie, Courage the Cowardly Dog, and... Old classic Hanna-Barbera cl classics such as the Jetsons, the Flintstones, 
And the Huckleberry Hound Show, Yogi Bear, Adam Ant, Jackie Chan Adventures, etc. Scythe the New Yorker is, what do you think of Flo Rida? I don't like her. Smoothie's World has four questions for me to answer. Do you like pizza? If so, what do you like on it? Number one. Number two, what is your dream vacation? Number three, how would you react if your house turned into a giant donut? Number four, what's your opinion on role-playing accounts? Number one, I do like pizza and I like sauce. I like to have sausage, uh, bell peppers, but not the chip side of the bell peppers. Olives, mushrooms, pepperonis, cheese, and bacon, including sausage or hamburgers or whatever it is. That's why I call it Supreme Pizza. Uh, Supreme Pizza is now my favorite kind of pizza. And I and I am think that it's very tasty and swell. No, I know what. No, I'm sorry, not swell. Uh, I think I must have watched too many Drew Pickles goes to videos, but it made me laugh. Number two, my dream vacation is to. And go to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, just because I see some of the wrestling arenas being held at being held at the Viking Hall, which is the ECW arena, including San Francisco, California, and San Antonio, Texas. And number three, I would be fucking surprised. Number four, mm -hmm. I'm neutral towards the. Role playing accounts. Alright. Dion the Train Kid gave me seven questions this time. Uh, number one, what happens if what happens if someone uses IRYO comments? Number two, what are your childhood shows? Number three, do you know me? Number four, when did you start recording videos in Moby Zen from your phone? Number five, are the UTTP and THD TCR are Part of a group of trolls. Number six, why is swearing part of a freedom of speech? Number seven, which users do you know? Uh, number one, I would be very pissed and I would start exposing them on Google+. Plus. Number two, my childhood shows are <clears throat> Caillou, uh, the old school of Sesame Street, and rug, uh, mostly Rugrats. And Mr. Rogers neighborhood. And number three. Yeah. Number four. Uh, when did you start recording? I started recording Moby Zen from my phone last year. A uh, few weeks. A uh, few weeks before my graduation. Yeah, before my senior year graduation. And number five. Uh, not really. Uh, they have good sides, but I still hate both different versions of the these two trolling communities. And number six, because it is. And number seven, uh, I've known too many people like Fine Lim, Ralph Fan, Cody McCone, Carla Ann, Madison Four, uh, and anyone else that I like, and then. And anyone else I'm okay with. My Little Pony, the Phoenix Fangirl Lover 360, gave me five questions. Number one, what's your opinion on My Little Pony, the movie? Number two, numbers two to five, do you love Demi Lovato, Selena Gomez, Alicia Cara, and Ariana Grande? Number one, I don't like it. Number two... Numbers two, three, and four. Uh, not really. I'm not in. I'm not into pop music. And number five. No, I don't. I hate Ariana Grande because she bashes opinions on, on Sea World by, forcing people to stop supporting Sea World. Yeah, that that's opinion bashing. All right. Sonya Lee gave me seven questions and and. Two separate Q&A videos that I just scheduled.
Number one, what do you think of the Polar Express? Number two, what will you do if I were a cat? Number one, um, I'm neutral towards the Polar Express. And number two, I would pet you and and feed you cat food and rub your tummy, etc. All right, Fidrin Frigate, Frigate, I can't pronounce his last name right. Okay, what do you think of this video I made? Uh, that's very cool, but, but to be honest, I'm really afraid of heights when it comes to big buildings. And more gigantic buildings like the size of a skyscraper. Alright, Andrew Neon Taki gave me two questions. Alright, number one, do you like the Loud House? Number two, what's your favorite Loud House episode? Number one, I don't even like the Loud House much, and I'm skipping number two since I'm not a fan of the Loud House. Ben Elite Estate 2017 is, I asked, what is your dream car? Uh, I got, I have no idea, man. Ronnie Zamora gave me two questions. One, have you heard of Malcolm in the Middle? Two, have you heard of Super Mario Logan before? If you did, then would you start watching it? Uh, have you heard of, I mean, number one, yeah, but I don't even like the show much. And number two, yeah, and it was last year after my, a uh, few months after my uh, senior year graduation. All right, it's been 12 minutes and I got to stop there. If you guys got any questions for me to answer, feel free to submit them. If you didn't hear me getting your answers questioned, then wait till the next episode. All right, peeps, this is Mesa Velez signing off.